Hey you guys, it's Barb from Barbara Lynn Budgets and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you're here. In today's video, you guys, I am going to do my savings challenges. So let me get the money and we'll give an account. Okay, so we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, and 200. So we are stuffing $200 today. Let me set this up really quick. I hope you guys are having a wonderful week. I am doing okay. It's um, one of the dog's birthdays and we are going to take her to Dairy Queen and get her a pup cup in a little bit. She already had a cheeseburger today. So anyway, I got this bag from Josie at Simple Plans. I love it. I think it's fantastic. So the first thing we're going to do, you guys, is Santa's Little Helper. And today we're going to add $2 because I do think I might be a dollar behind. So I'm just going to go ahead and add $2. So we're going to color this one in. And I will come back and color these off camera to make them look better. But I just want to show you that I'm coloring those two in. And I'm adding two singles to this envelope. This is a freebie that came from Lisa Grateful Me. And it's just a savings to save a um, dollar a week until Black Friday. And so around that time, you could use this money to bless somebody. And that is what my plan is. So now we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. So I think that that is correct now. I think that's where I'm supposed to be. $19 in Santa's Little Helper. Okay, next up, you guys, is the 100 Envelope Challenge with a Twist. I also got this from Lisa Grateful Me. If you don't know what that is, it's just envelopes 1 through 25 four times. So I cannot do the regular 100 envelope challenge right now. I just don't have the funds to fill the, the larger envelopes, like, you know, the 190 in the 90s. So I just think this is a better way for me to do the 100 envelope challenge, and it'll equal $1,300 when it is complete. So today we are going to put $25 in here. Actually, we're going to put $26. We're going to do number 21 there and number five. So let me get my box out. So here's our box. It's a great big box. And we are going to get number 21 here and number 5 here. I'll move those out of the way for a moment. Okay, we're going to put a 20 and a 1 in this envelope. And we're going to put a 5 in this envelope. I mean, I obviously I got these envelopes from like the Dollar Tree and I got this big box that I use from Staples. So this was a pretty cheap challenge for me. I didn't have to pay for a bunch of envelopes that I couldn't afford. So I'll put these back here. The pink paper just differentiates what has been done from what has not. Let me put the box away. And I will go ahead and color in 21 here and five here. Okay, that is it for the 100 envelope with a twist for this week. Next, you guys, we're going to do the 52 week savings challenge. And so we Last week was week 30, so we're going to put $31 in here, 20, 10, and a single. All right, so I got this from Tina at A Pink Cloth Life, and this challenge is coming right along. I'm pretty excited about finishing this and being able to count it pretty soon. Well, I mean, it won't be until the end of September, but... I'm still excited about this. So that's it for this week. 
So next up is my savings challenge binder. And so in this binder, we are going to add $10 to this challenge. I got this challenge from Erica Budgets. It was from the Women's International Day. It was from International Women's Day, I should say. So I'm going to add $10 and I'm going to color in one of these. I am using this to save money to purchase a printer. I probably have enough now to purchase a printer. Um, I'm going to start looking for them and see, but I'll keep filling this in because I want to complete it. So now in the this savings challenge, we have 100, 20, 30, and 40. Next up, you guys, is my 26-week savings challenge. And um, I got a little ahead of myself last week, and I colored in the 30, even though I wasn't supposed to. So we're stuffing that 30 this week. So there's 20 and 10. Let's give this a count. So now in the 20, 26-week savings challenge, we have 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 380, 385, and 390. All right, next up is Save 250. We're gonna save $9 this week. I need to get out my Save 250 book. Okay, so this is the Ultimate Book of Savings Challenges. It was one of my very first, well, it was my very first savings challenge book. Actually, it's my only savings challenge book, but we're gonna color in this nine. I'm just gonna scribble it in and I'll come back and finish it later just to show you guys that this is where we're at. Let me move it off to the side and we're gonna add $9, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So now we will count this and see where we're at here. So now in Save 250, we have 100, <laughs> no we don't, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. It would be nice if we had a couple hundred dollars in there, but we don't have that yet, so that's okay. Next up will be the mini savings challenge for my pets. This is to fund an, um, an emergency fund for them. So I'm doing two challenges at the same time. I got this savings challenge from Tracy at Golden Girl Budgets and I got this savings challenge from Madeline at Madeline Budgets. I'm gonna put $5 in each one of them. I'm gonna color an icon off camera and I will be right back. So there's the five colored in, there's the dog dish colored in. We're gonna add $10 here and we will give it a count and see where we're at. So now in our pet emergency, we are at 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, and 70. Next up is the $10 savings challenge, which I have back here. Today we are putting $10 in and I'm gonna color one of these stars. So we're just gonna add a 10 and we'll give it a count and see where we're at. I believe we should be at 520. So we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 10 and 20. Not too bad. So next up is B-Books. I have to go print a tracker because I don't have any right now, but I'm just gonna save these in here. And when I get the tracker, I'll fill it in. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, and 13 towards the new tracker. See if I would have bought my printer already. I could just print it out myself. So next up is the $2,000 savings challenge. And today we're gonna to add $22 to 
to this right there. All right, we're gonna color this one. And just like the other ones, I'll come back in and do a better job off camera. So let's add 20, 21, and 22 and count this up. I was thinking about taking part of this and just go ahead and depositing it to the bank so I don't have this much money sitting in my house. I think I might do that. So in the $2,000 savings challenge, we now have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 750, 8, 859, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. So we have 936. So the $100 savings challenge, last time we were together, I scratched off that 20 right there. So I'm gonna add 20 to, well, I've done pulled everything out. Okay, so this 100 goes here with this lumberjack and then this goes here. So in this $100 savings challenge, we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85. Okay, so I'm gonna scratch this for next week. I believe it's 15. I'm just gonna use a quarter because I don't know where my little lucky dollar is at the moment. And so next week when we're together, I will add $15 to the savings challenge to finish it. And that will be $200 towards me paying myself back for paying for my kids tuition. So I owe myself $420. So this will be 200 and then I'm gonna add a $100 savings challenge. That would make it 300. And then this next challenge behind here is for 120. So that will be the 420 total. So today this one is going to get $10. I mean, $5, I'm sorry, it's getting five. So let me color in one heart. And I'm gonna add the $5. Okay, next is the Save 500 savings box that I got from Salisa at Beautifully Me and You. And today we are going to add $10. So we're gonna mark off this 10 right here. Oop, this is not the right color purple. We are gonna mark off this $10 right here, okay? And we're gonna add $10 to this. And this normally comes in a box, but she also sells it in the envelope, but I want it from her, so I want it in the envelope. You can get a $500 savings challenge, $1,000 or 2,500. I was good with 500. So in the $500 savings challenge, we have 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 1, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So 115, and we are in section six. Well, I definitely didn't do this right, you guys. This goes in the front. Okay. Okay, so that is that is it for those savings challenges, and I have one more savings challenge for you. Okay, you guys, last and certainly not least is my finishing up my April savings challenge. I mean, it is May 4th, may the 4th be with you, and it is the my puppy's birthday. Well, she's my daughter's puppy, but I love her so much. So t I'm gonna fill in these three umbrellas, and then we'll add the 15 here and give it a count. And this is my monthly savings challenge. I'll be right back. All right, so there is the completed challenge. We're gonna add $15. Let's give it a count and see where we're at. So now in my monthly challenge, we have 51, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 3, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30. So 330. 
And next up, you guys, is May. So the next time we're together, I'll start doing this one. It's very pretty, purple flowers. So that's all I have for you guys today. I appreciate you so much for being here. Um, if you made it this far, thank you so much. I know that this was a little bit of a hot mess, but that's just how it is sometimes. So please remember that Jesus loves you. I do too, and I'll see you guys soon with um, another savings challenge video or maybe a cash stuffing. I'm not really sure yet, but I will see you soon. So have a great day. Bye guys.